Hi everyone, uh, we are in the Arakads region in the village of Ushi. Uh, we are with Asmi Govanisyan uh, at the Centaur Hippotherapy Center. Asmi, thank you for, for taking the time out to show us uh, the center. Um, to start off with, can you tell us a little bit about what hippotherapy is? Yes, um, uh, I will try to explain it in simple words. It's hippotherapy is from the Greek word hippos, meaning horse and therapy, meaning therapy. And um, it's, um, it is kind of uh, physical therapy that utilizes equine movement. Uh, so it's, we, use, we use three main factors here, we use three main factors. First, horse pace is similar to our pace. Uh -huh. uh, horse pace is similar to our pa pace. So uh, his spine does the same movement than our spine while walking, which is just perfect for those who has um, um, like motion disorders. So uh, let's say with cerebral palsy. Mm -hmm. And second is the horse temperature is uh, the horse body's temperature is one one and a half degrees higher than our body temperature, so all our muscles get very strong heating massage. And also, horse does over a hundred movements while walking at the same time in different directions, and all our muscles repeat those that those movements. Uh, this is uh, physical side of hypotherapy and emotional side is uh, horse has, like, every animal and every human being has uh, its own energy right and horse energy is very strong like that those that energetical field is very strong and it's um, it's very strong stimulus because uh, especially in Armenia we, uh, handicapped people they have uh, lack of atten attention and they always had now things are better but still they have and in rehabilitation centers we never underestimate the importance of rehabilitation centers but it's boring mm -hmm. when uh, the child is just lying down and someone is bending his hand or, or leg or whatever and here they don't feel they undergo therapy they just come for horse, for horse They're having riding a good time. and yeah and it's the first time in their life when they are over and not under and they are higher than everybody and with their sick um, like sick or weak hand they control that big animal and that gives you a feeling even if um, you are not handicapped that horse riding gives you a feeling like I am the king of the universe. If I can do it, I can do everything else. So it, it, so it could be from factor. small children to, to adults? Yeah, it can be eight, nine months old child to hundreds <laughs> years old. Well, the, the earlier you start, of course, uh, the more results you, you get. Mm -hmm. That's that's really interesting. So it has to do with like the rhythm of the animal, yes. the emotions, and the, the emotional side of it. Like you said, it's, it's, it's something that's not not the same old thing over and over again yeah, it's exactly. outdoors it's exactly. it's it's with living breathing animals um can you tell us a, some success stories that, that 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 you've had um how long has the center been open uh we've been working here a bit for a bit over three years we started hypotherapy in yerevan mm -hmm. so it could in total uh, over four years but here in Oshi around uh, three years is um, this just getting introduced to the country like was yes. This, was this the first of its kind? Yeah, we uh, we started hypotherapy. There were attempts to start hypotherapy in Armenia, but they all failed. And uh, we started hypotherapy, and I started it in Georgia. They have really good school, and in fact, they uh, they began hypotherapy in Soviet Union, and they invented lots of uh, things in hypotherapy in all uh, in all the world. So they have very good school. And even my teacher didn't believe uh, I'm, I'm going to continue because uh, it's not popular in Georgia now. It's, it doesn't bring money, so young people don't want to go into it. So we, we introduced it. And uh, success stories, now, uh, what is interesting, like we have uh, many autistic children uh -huh. here who, would, who did not speak before they come for horse riding. And all of them, they the first or when they started speaking, the first word it always was horse. Horse, yeah. <laughs> See. And it's something you know uh, when it's something physical or it uh, it has to do with muscles and all, you can't explain it. But when it goes to some energy, emotional part, you, you even never can explain why <laughs> why it is so. Because for horse riding, they don't need to pronounce the word horse. 
but it's uh, and also we have uh, like m my favorite success story is a girl who she could walk when she came here but she was uh, she was hung by two m two people's hands and she was mainly walking with hands uh, while with like and she was just eight years old when she came uh, for hypotherapy now she's been doing it for two years and she, she's very very strong with very strong will and uh, willingness to, to survive to walk and etc and uh, we did a great job with her she started walking she now makes up to 15 16 steps on her uh, on her own and she does it um, she does it correctly because when we move our first leg goes on a uh, left shoulder with the first leg we even don't notice yeah it. i don't notice and the opposite <laughs> and she has cerebral palsy weak muscles and especially children with cerebral palsy when they start walk, if they start walk, they they walk like this, like mm -hmm. like road. And she does the ro proper movement, and uh, and it is thanks to to the horse. So it's uh, it's we we put really much work on her, and it it gave results. That's incredible. How can people help um, either adopting animals um, or helping um, support this work that you guys are doing? Yeah, we have. Um, Except some four horses, all our animals are rescued. We have even uh, the, our main hypotherapy horse, Salma. Salma. She, yeah, we bought her not to not to get her slaughtered because her owner wanted to slaughter her. Uh, she's an amazing horse. She's she's just creative for hypotherapy. And also we have some ten dogs, all rescued dogs, and uh, we involve them uh, in the work with children, especially you know with those children who are afraid of the horse only as a, of a big animal. And dogs are smaller and they are very friendly, they are trained to be friendly and they are amazing with children. So they start overcoming their fear with dogs. And also um, petting the dog, playing with the dog is very good for that. Um, for when, you, when a child has problems with fingers, mm. and that small motoric, it's very good uh, for that. Uh, we have... Um, uh, we also ha we have a main problem here that we cooperate with the owner who is who put the territory for sale uh, the um, riding ring and stable and horses uh, everything and we are s we, s we are trying to get money to buy it otherwise like hypotherapy will die in Armenia you know to find a new territory and to train new horses and it it takes time so is there, a, is there a website, is there a Facebook group? Is yeah. There, how can we support uh, your work? Uh, how can we support the animals and uh, continuing hypotherapy in, uh, in Armenia? Yeah, we have, we have a website and we have Facebook group and we have bank account. We actually, we now we organize fundraising to, to buy at least horses from him and then to think of buying the territory because the horses are well trained and we also had a program of adopting uh, animals mm -hmm. uh, you become adoptive parent for a year and it's a symbolic sum it's not a big money but then uh, it's you it's your share in um, in their care well i've never ridden the horse and i'm getting ready to so um husband thank you very much for 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 uh, uh taking the time out with us Welcome, thank you. Straighten your and off. Uh -huh, yeah, that was great. And put your, your foot in it, yeah? but not not too deep. It's even deep. A bit. You've never ridden, also? okay? <laughs> so hold on the saddle in the beginning. And body will walk you a little bit. You'll get used, and you're cold, right? Um, okay. <laughs> and you'll get used to the height. <laughs> Try to keep legs close to the horse, like, like this, heels down, toes up, yes. Yeah.